Hello and welcome back to Hearthstone with me here. I'm Casper and I'll be rocking you today here at the rock bottom. This week's Tavern Brawl is a little bit different from last week's, so I've gone ahead and just... Well, cheated a little bit. I said a couple of things last time that uh, are going to contradict with today's program, so let's just get to it. This is all about staying below the enemy and then just finishing big. And I think I have just the right deck for this. Or not. Let's see. <laughs> so yeah. I went with the Warlock because I think the Warlock has the uh, the best ability to, uh, to keep his health down. And then of course I've just put in some security features to stop myself from dying horribly in a giant ball of fire that's great let's pray to the fire lord that uh, this works Uther. I will right. fight with honor your soul shall be mine you see I've, I've gone with something that that oh my god this is this is going to be terrible well Everything I've got is all about, yeah, masochism, I guess. So let's just... Well, that's a good opener in, in any case. Let's see what you have to answer that, Mr. Paladin. This is a, this is a battle for the ages. This is the good old... Time. Oh, shit. Uh, right. That could potentially be terrible. Alright. Let's try this. Oh, that's perfect. I was quite sure that was going to be what it was. So that sucks. So how does this work? It's it's supposed to uh, to summon something when I'm down a certain amount of health, but I'm not quite sure when it does it. Oh Reporting my goodness! Are ah, you kidding me? Ready your lance, there it goes. That is not <laughs> helpful. Uh, well, this is. Let the pain speak Job to done. me. So it. Uh, yeah. So it summons it on the next turn. Well, that's something at the very least. Not on my watch. Let's well, see, I've also got this thing where I can restore health to, uh, to the other guy. Should it happen that, uh, yeah. Should it happen that that he's playing with the same tactics as I am? Oh, that is not for now. Shit. Let's just go with. Uh, Bring the pain. Let's do that. Oh, that is brilliant. That is one big flesh eating ghoul now. Anyway, so let's just. That is a big, scary ghoul. Perfect. This is perfect. This is going well. Master of death. Reporting for duty. This is perfect. Yeah. See, see, that's where you have my. Uh, this, this is going to help me survive in the end. Oh, that is terrible on ev in every way. <laughs> God damn it. All right. So if I, I could do that. No, I couldn't. Uh, I could 
to that. But then I would have to salt fire. Let's not do that. And now we are at that point where if I do that's free damage, that's not gonna help me. I have to pit lord, I or else wonder. I'm not gonna get a new minion. Well, that's alright. Competitive spirits. It's fine. That's terrible. It's terrible. I'm gonna lose a mana crystal. Not on my watch. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Yes, here we go. Reporting for duty. I am Back in the game. Jesus Christ, this guy is fond of shields. I am out of the game again. That sucks. If I heal him by five, I get another minion. A random minion, that is. That would just render my pit lord absolutely useless. So what can I do? Can I? Five, seven, nine, 13. Oh, that's close. Let's just go for it. Then he gets a damn cobra. God damn it. Well, three, five, seven, eight, ten. Ah, oh, you have no room to summon a murloc. You, you're dead. You're super dead. Oh, he has a weapon too. Well, ah, yes, that's how you do it. That is how you do it. What are you even doing? Well... He knew that was coming. He was, uh... He was quite obviously... Oh, look at that. He was quite obviously banking on the Murloc, but, uh... Forgot about the, uh... The issue with space on the board! So, um, let's see what's in the pack. It's a good old classic pack. It's fine. Oh, look at that. Nice. Cool. These are all pretty cool cards. Let's, um, let's have another with this thing. I just, just had an idea. You know what? Maybe that, maybe I'll record another episode. And, uh, and I'll do the opposite, just healing the opponent above above the borderline. <laughs> that's that's terrible, but Good potentially day. hilarious. Oh, look at that! The light shall bring victory. Your soul shall be mine. See if our if our strategies clash here. This is gonna be very bad. Oh my goodness, that was not better. <laughs> the light shall burn you. Yes, yes. I greet you. 
I could do. Oof. <laughs> yeah, that's not gonna help me right now either. Let's just coin a pyromancer. Why do we? Because then we can answer it with mortal coil if we need to. What's he doing? Oh. Well, I guess. I hope that didn't just screw me over entirely. It may have. It may very well have. I just. I thought. I thought the pyromancer was just. Nah. You know, it's not that. It's not that important because it doesn't damage me. But but then I remembered. The amazing place last game. Amazing and amazing. I, I mean, the fair place I did last game with the ghoul and the and the acolyte and stuff. Yeah, that would be pretty good. Okay. It kind of seems like people are not playing the gimmick. That sucks. We just yeah, let's just Oh Perfect. Yeah. Let's just leave it there. Come on, little man. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. See the the appeal of this gimmick, just like with the with the portal one. Is that it's a random minion that you get. You could potentially get Are you well, mocking me? anything. And then I get stuff like this. Absolute crock. Like that. What am I gonna do with that? Whatever. Oh, wait. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Fine. I just need more low cost stuff. I well, can put out the cult master or ah, abomination is just a waste here. And and berserker. <laughs> the berserker is good with the um, with the ghoul on the board, unless he uh, he pops it now. <laughs> Tried and true combo. Ah, you. Why is it, why is it always the? You know what? I'm just gonna sacrifice you straight up, straight away. Just boom, done with you. Let's just circle on. You think this is funny? Then we get a big ass sir. That's perfect. And I can I have I have the mortal coil that I can uh, that I can buff it up further with. And yes, to a minion good. I have the imp pit lord and a kraken if anything goes completely wrong. See I kinda I kinda like the, I was thinking about putting more of, of, of like the, the kraken stuff in here. That sucks. But it was, it was only this turn, right? Yeah. I was considering putting more of, of the crane like deal damage instead of the deal damage to your hero stuff, but you know, you can't have everything. Is that the other smite or is it a death? It's the death! I guess that's not the worst that could happen. Let me just... Oh wait. Join or die, or both. <laughs> you think this is fun? 
This is a lot of card draw. Oh, that's beautiful. Alright. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Right. So right, oh wow. I'm burning <laughs> through the deck fast. It's time for a little blood. Alright, I hope. I didn't screw myself over completely by filling up my hand like this. My <laughs> Why is it always the fire lord thing? <laughs> that's terrible. Alright. I have a hellfire, but that's not gonna help me here. So let's just... What do I do? Imp. Dancing master. That wouldn't be a very good idea. <laughs> Who is next? Oh, there's something. Let's just pop another aim out there. There we go. Ah, uh, that's gonna fill up, isn't it? Fencing coach. Beautiful card. I love it. It's perfect. Flame Wager. Well, it has served me well in the past. It would be terrible here, so. I must it's consider. I still got the pit lord. I still got. Oh my goodness, this is terrible. Embrace the void. Ooh. Oh. So that's that's pretty good. Still got all of that. All of that. I can taste the mana. Oh, look at that. Mana addict. Ah, oh, finally. Just out of reach for Infernal. Doesn't matter. Die. Boss out there. Uh, let's not tap right now. Still got Hellfire for uh, and two abominations. That. Well, at least it wasn't the ghoul, but damn, that sucks. But I can I can buff the ghoul up and I can get another imp out of it. There's a lot of stuff I can do. And I can put myself behind the, the beautiful wall of an abomination. Or I can just kill the sun. I got an owl. I got. Why is it always the one with the battle cries? Is it worth it to put Kel'Thuzad out there? Is there any way that I can actually so many possibilities. kill that shield master and put Kel'Thuzad out there? Well, of course it would resurrect the ghoul. But would it resurrect it with all of its buffs? Probably not. Mm. You know what? Let's just do it. Now, okay. 
summons it in standard form. That's to be expected. Oh my goodness. Yeah, don't mind control it. Don't mind control it. I am an idiot. I am the biggest... Oh my goodness. That's beautiful. gonna death it, he's gonna death it. Do you have anything? Yeah, it's just gonna ram it in. Ram it in. I left with no board. And everything belongs to me. So he has one card. Why is it shit this week? <laughs> Let's just go with the right <laughs> Splashes a little water. Eleven, twelve, fifteen. Right. So Infernal. It's the same. It's just in one character. I don't think that's gonna do me any good. Abomination. Oh, and I have Hellfire as well. So if necessary. Oh, right. sucks all right so i can deal 15 damage and i can put down an abomination and deal five more right yeah two and five that's not enough and stuff's gonna die from it so many possibilities you know what if it <laughs> Oh, it doesn't die from Hellfire. What, we do? what am I even thinking then? You know what? Screw it. It works anyway. Oh my goodness, that's cool. Still gonna die, buddy. Still gonna die. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh my lord. I don't think that counts. Doesn't count. Okay, so now I am fiercely dependent on... Well played. All hail the Fire Lord. <laughs> wow. That was unholy and I did not deserve that. Let's do it again. Some tavern brawls might come back again in the future. I am happy to hear that. I would love to play the uh, portal one again. Just a million times. That would be amazing. Gul'dan versus Gul'dan. Now here's someone who Your may have gotten the same mind. idea as me. Your soul shall suffer. Now, just in case you're new at, uh, at all this Hearthstone thing, this is not a great opening <laughs> Oh, God. This is slightly better 
but only slightly. I'm gonna hang on to the pyromancer this time. Yeah, that's perfect. That's a lot better. Yeah. Then I can tap next turn, or I can gang boss, depending on what happens. Definitely need to keep my health down as well. So, considering he's got nothing on the board right now, I'm just gonna tap again. This actually, this is actually interesting. Look, he even has the same card back as me. What's he doing? What's he doing? What are you doing? Nothing apparently. Oh. Fire the lasers. Well, it's a, it's it's something. So if I pop that down, I can tap as well. So I destroy this. Why would you even have that? So many possibilities. I guess that works. This is, uh... I'm feeling very tense about this. Very tense, actually. I'm, I'm not quite sure how this is going to go. Following each other, oh poor fish. We're following each other quite nicely. Oh, look, a kite. Mm. Uh oh. And the second hellfire. That's good, I guess. So, I, it's not worth it to, to put up pyromancer and gangbus shenanigans without actually him having stuff on the board. I so, wonder. I guess I'll just... Let the pain speak to me. Give me your best. So now he's in the lead. Well, underdog style in the lead. Right. He's not losing health, just... Oh my goodness. Goodness gracious me, that is perfect. Well, there goes the gang boss. Let's try for a... Yes, you are perfect for this. Uh... Oh, right, there he was again. Could have mortal coil, but whatever. Let's just stay low with him. Cult master fits perfectly well with the theme as well. What I was trying to say, the uh, the acolyte of pain, he's uh, he's feeling this kind of playstyle. I think there comes the mortal coil. Touche. Touche indeed. So what do we got? Right. So I I guess I just pit lord. And I don't tap. I don't tap on this one. <laughs> Fuck. The scourge will consume you. You know what? I I considered putting Rivendare in the deck just because. Oh my goodness! I considered putting Rivendare in the deck just because he's hilarious and he does a lot of crazy stuff. But it's not really the uh, the death rattle heaviest deck, so yeah, I decided against it just because. 
So, um, yeah. I also considered putting the, uh, what was it? The sacrificial pact in, but uh, it heals me, so I thought, nah, that's stupid. Let's not do that. So, what can we do here? We can... No, we can't. Alright, I was thinking about... I pyromancer coin infernal. Yeah, that's stupid. Let's do that. Do you like to play with fire? Just because it's hilarious. I can pop kill the start next turn. Mmm, that's uh Wow, it's like it's a year ago. Oh my god! Put this apple on your head. I hate when I get what I deserve. Silent night. Silent. Yeah, that's that was obvious. So let's. That minion, a uh, well, he's going to survive being hellfired. So, ah, uh, but uh, I'm going to need to do something before I can hellfire. So many possibilities. I'm going to I'm going to have to do something about Rivendare before I Hellfire. But can I? I don't know what order does you know, of course the Hellfire comes first and then the death rattle. There's no really, there's not really a way out of this, is there? So that was terrible because can that attack right away? Can it? If so, I'm dead. I'm just straight up dead. It can attack right away. Well, I guess that is the logical conclusion of uh, of a lifestyle and where you uh, you do nothing but uh, harm yourself. That's a lesson, kids. Well, I think that's gonna be it. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, like, comment, and subscribe for more crazy, stupid shit.